All progress in medicine really is due to clinical trials. That we have to prove that something works before we do it, or we have to know that it's safe to do. But that's not the only purpose of clinical trials. We're offering a clinical trial because we think that there's the potential of receiving better care. We know that there usually is some benefit. What we're trying to figure out is, is it enough of a benefit to start offering it as standard treatment? There are clinical trials offered in every type of cancer. The question is, do you qualify for a clinical trial? And that really depends on what cancer you have, what clinical trials are available. The best person to decide that is the physician who's treating you. If they do not discuss clinical trials at all, it's very reasonable just to ask the question, do I qualify for any clinical trials? Are there any clinical trials that you would suggest? Asking the question does not mean that you will be doing a clinical trial. It just opens the discussion, and it's a really important discussion to have. If you are offered a clinical trial, I think it's really important for you to understand what is going on in the clinical trial. How much of a risk are you taking by being in the clinical trial? There are several clinical trials that offer zero risk to the patient. We're testing a new technology that's of no risk to you at all. Those are much easier decisions than deciding if you want to be randomized between receiving drug A for chemotherapy or drug B for chemotherapy. Both are equally important clinical trials and may make a difference in how you're treated.